all right so now we're gonna I'm gonna cut it down this I'm cutting off all the all the green let's taste and see how this watermelon is mm 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 it's so good now I'm gonna cut it into chunks and then I'm gonna put it in a lock and lock and I don't want to waste any of it and then the bed of course I'm gonna toss out all right I didn't do that you can't for a reason mm -mm. <laughs> Cut like this and cut down like this. Toss it away. I always cut it into when I get a watermelon home because I didn't do that. <laughs> it'll last longer because it, it will continue to ripen. Here's another one. I don't, we don't eat the rind, we just eat the insides. And I just love watermelon. And you saw David's video cutting a watermelon, and this is kind of how I do it. I just cut it into chunks and let people kind of have it how they want to. But I always cut the watermelon down smaller because it's just easier to handle. Ugh. Now, imagine just taking that out and munching on that. I could do that, you know. <laughs> That's a really nice watermelon. All right, let's cut this down again. Yeah, and see, it makes for a, a nice little treat to munch on, too. And imagine taking, if you wanted to, that drink recipe I got, took it Freeze that watermelon juice and make watermelon ice cubes. Put me in a drink. That'd be cool. All right, on our drinks channel. See this one big watermelon here? And this is a small watermelon compared. I've seen bigger watermelons. And this is seedless, so I like... I kind of like the seedless ones. You know, yeah. I don't even think I got a big enough container for the watermelons. Yep. I got a watermelon vote. Mm -hmm. Yep. So you can chop it. Basically, I just, you know, cut it up. And it's really easy to cut a watermelon. It's not hard to cut. Especially when you have a knife like this. I asked if they take a whole dish of watermelons and munch on it. I mean, who wouldn't? <laughs> I see it, the container we got isn't even big enough for all the watermelon bits. That's okay. We got more containers. Now they hit the bigger half, <laughs> and we already filled that up. Look at all them. That one part of that watermelon made all that. Let me find another container. Yeah. I'm cutting this one in half again.
And always wash your hands like I did before you start. Make sure you set on a clean table. And I got my cutting board here, but the ta whole table is basically a cutting board. I don't need the rind, so what we, we're doing is just basically cutting <coughs> off the rind. Making sure there's no rind in it. Yep. Now I got a little mini boat. <laughs> I'm going to have this boat sink. Mm. Okay. Chop, 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 chop. I was hoping I could have got it all in one chop. Picked it up, but. Alright, I'm going to cut this down again. Alright, We're Donnie, almost done this watermelon. You can become a sous chef. Huh? I see you can become a sous chef. Why do you say that? Chop, chop. <laughs> Why? You know, they chop, 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 chop. <laughs> I guess I am kind of fast at cutting. <laughs> I had years of experience of cutting. So you just kind of cut. It's too wide. Yep. Cut part way down like that, and then the flat part you just cut across like this. I've got a chocolate covered watermelon. Oh, is it good? I don't know. Something we need to try. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm uh, for chop chocolate covered anything. You like chocolate? We like watermelon? So. I like watermelon. It's my favorite. I don't know why watermelon is seasonal. It shouldn't be because we got greenhouses. We should be able to get yeah, watermelon year round. I, think. I don't I don't understand why watermelons are seasonal. Because they grow watermelons inside of Center. That's not even outside. Okay, here we go. Yep. Here we go. Okay. And there it is. You saw me. And you saw me cut this entire... Mm. <laughs> I cut it out myself. <laughs> there it is. I don't know how long it 